Um, the state of healthcare, of course, is being de debated with election coming up and that's something that's on front of mind for everybody. And I spoke with Nancy Brown, who is the CEO of the American Heart Association, and she has something we can all do to join the fight against surprise medical bills. So let's find out firstly, what are they and what we can do to stop any unforeseen burdens that may come up when we have something happen that's out of our control. Check this out on AM Buffalo. Good morning. Chances are you know someone or you are someone who has received a surprise medical bill. Half of all Americans have been hit with one. Nancy Brown, CEO of the American Heart Association, joins us now to talk about how ending surprise medical bills could be as simple as a hashtag. I like a surprise, but a surprise medical bill is not <laughs> a good thing, Nancy. What is it exactly? A surprise medical bill happens to patients when they unknowingly receive care from a doctor or a healthcare provider who's outside their insurance company's network, or if they're accessing emergency care where they're not able to choose their medical transport company, their hospital, or their doctor, which can be so financial financially devastating for people and the average surprise medical bill is more than six hundred dollars but could also uh, amount to thousands and tens of thousands of dollars for people that get emergency care so really devastating stuff for people and patients i mean that's really scary especially when you think that you might be covered has it been worse with the pandemic there's no question that during a global pandemic people um, have been forced to out of network uh, hospital care, which really underscores the need for a legislative solution to this problem. The COVID-19 pandemic has magnified this issue of addressing surprise medical billing. And that's why at the American Heart Association, we're relentlessly focused on fixing this issue. What is the solution? How can you protect yourself from something like this? Our elected officials need to take action and for almost two years, the American Heart Association has been working with lawmakers on both sides of the aisle, urging them to address the issue. But unfortunately, this issue of ending surprise medical billing has not been prioritized. And that's why we're leading a national campaign, encouraging patients to share their story about receiving surprise bills. We urge people to, to go to their social media accounts, tell their story, using the hashtag I was billed um, and this way we can get the voices of patients alongside each other um, to demand that Congress end surprise medical billing now. Oh that I think that is so good I mean I feel we've all got a story of a friend or someone that we know who has gone into debt over a surprise medical bill so that is amazing work so where can we go to find out more to support this if we're interested? Please visit us at heart.org slash surprise bills and there you can get more information you can get involved and you can be reminded to tell your story at hashtag i was billed and we know that this will really matter in getting this bipartisan solution over the finish line